Welcome to WWE Max Soccer, where we take a look at the most controversial plays of MLS Soccer over Week 23. A lot of controversy this weekend, so let's go. We're in Orlando for the 7th minute. DC United, Orlando, 0-0 so far. Looks like there's a bit of a foul over there. Now, is this a foul? Let's take a little bit of a closer look at this. 1-on-1, one one, whoa, 2-on-1. Both goes for the legs. I think this is clear and obvious. Yellow card, great call by the referee. LAFC Seattle in the 27th, 26th minutes. LFC, LAFC grabs the possession of the ball and makes it to the back of the net. But wait, is this a goal? The referee, Joe Dickerson, goes to check video review and calls it no goal because of a handball. Let's take a closer look at this. It touches the his wrist. Still a handball. His hand is in a natural position. But unfortunately, that does touch his upper hand. Great catch by the referee. If this was not a goal-scoring opportunity, I would personally not have called this. His hand's in a natural position. But because this is resulting in a goal, you have to call stuff like this as a referee. Great catch by the referee, Joe Dickerson. Chicago FC versus Atlanta FC. We have a lot of viewers watching from these two states, so let's get, focus on this one. Atlanta is able to put it into the back of the net. Crowd goes wild, but wait, the referee goes to check video review and gets this call right. It is offsides, no goal, and the referee sees this through video review. Great call by the referees. Miami, Cincinnati. Okay, bear with me over here. There looks like there's a little bit of a foul, but let's focus on this one. Both going for the ball. It looks like Miami is able to touch the ball, gain possession of it for less than half a second, which means this is no foul. He touches the ball before foul get, being fouled, simply meaning there is no foul here. This is a clear and obvious no foul. It looks like there's a little bit of rough play, but... He, He's able to gain possession of the ball before he is fouled. No foul. Great call. Or should I say great no call. Still in Miami versus Cincinnati. Oh, looking for a PK over there. Let's 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 take a look. And so does Tori Penzo, the referee. Goes to check video review to take a look at this. Is there a foul here or is there offsides here? He calls it a penalty. Okay, there we go. It is a penalty. Let's take a look. There looks like there's a little bit of contact here. Li oh, a little bit of contact. A lot of contact over there. And this is a great call by referee Tori Penzo. This is not clear and obvious, simply meaning that if you don't really focus on this, you could miss this call. Amazing note. Amazing call by Tori Penzo. The tricky one for this episode of WW Max Soccer, Toronto, New England. Toronto in white, New England in blue, Toronto setting up for a goal, and then that happens. There's a takedown. Uh-oh. What happens here? Referee Ismer Pe Peckmick is pointing to the spot for a penalty. Referee Ismer Peckmick goes to check video review to check what exactly happened here, and let's see what happens here. Toronto goes for the ball fouls New England in the process. I believe that this is a penalty. Happening in the box, endangering the safety of a player. I ha I'd have no problem if Izmir Pekme gave this player a red card as well. This is endangering the safety of a player. Clear and obvious red card if he's nice, yellow card, and I don't think a penalty is enough for that one, but uh, overall, he caught that one. SKC versus ATX. Let's take a look. There's a goal, but wait, it's not a goal. <laughs> Excuse my comedy. <laughs> um, but let's take a look. Referee Photos Bazaukas goes to check video review to check for a possible offsides. In my opinion, there is no angle here to call this offsides. There's no angle here to be proven that is offsides. It looks like a clear and obvious play. It looks like an onside play. There's no angle that can tell otherwise. And because uh, SKC in blue 
is in front of the la- in, behind the last offender in Miami. As this may look all sides, this is an onside play, and so Fotis Bazokas thinks so as well. This is a goal and a clear and obvious goal. Thank you for watching this episode of WW Max Soccer. We'll see you next week for week 24. Let me know in the comments what was the most controversial play in this game. Thanks for watching. We'll see.